Hey guys, welcome back to Next Gen Blogger and in this video, I want to show you how you can create a rectangle slider in VSCC free video editor. So what I've done is I've imported two demo images in the editor and this is my first demo image and this is my second demo image. And as you can see, my first demo image contains just the text and my second demo image contains the text along with a long shadow. And so what I intend to do is I intend to create a rectangle slider which will move from the left hand side of the screen to the right hand side of the screen and gradually my long shadow will be visible. So without further delay let's get started. Now the first thing which we will do is we will pull down this first image below like this and let me just decrease the duration of my first image. So currently the duration of my first image, that is this image, is 5 seconds. So let me just decrease the duration from 5 seconds to 2 seconds 500 milliseconds. Perfect. Now place the second image right above the first image like this. And increase the duration of the second image. So duration of the second image currently is 5 seconds. So let me just increase the duration from 5 to 10 seconds. Perfect. And now what you need to do is double click on your second image and we will add a wipe transition. So go to video effects, go to transitions, select wipe and then click on OK. Now look inside the wipe settings which is present inside the properties window and the type currently is set to door. So change the type from door to side and mode is right to left, so that's fine. Directly is set to false. So once again, change this from false to true. And inside the gradient length option, as you can see, the value is 50. So change the value from 50 to 0. Now place your wipe transition right at the beginning like this. And increase the duration of the wipe transition. So currently the duration of the wipe transition is 1 seconds. So increase the duration of the wipe transition from 1 second to 2 second 500 millisecond. Perfect. And so now let me just quickly play the video for you. Perfect. So now we will create a rectangle slider. So what you need to do is you need to go to add object, select rectangle and then click on OK. Now mark your rectangle object right outside the screen on the left hand side like this. And uh, to make things simple, look inside the coordinates section which is present inside the properties window. So first of all, as you can see, the left coordinate currently minus 82 is there. So write minus 15. And now top coordinate is 0, 0.000, so that's fine. Width is 23.000. So change the width from 23.000 to 15.000. And height is 1080.000, so that's fine. All right. Now what you need to do is you need to decrease the duration of the rectangle object. So currently the duration of the rectangle object is 10 seconds. So decrease the duration from 10 seconds to 2 seconds 500 milliseconds. Perfect. And now double click on the rectangle object. And now we will add our movement object. So go to add object, go to movement, click on movement and then click on OK. Now using the movement cursor, move your rectangle from the left hand side of the screen to the right hand side of the screen like this. Place it properly so that take your time and place it properly just next to the screen on the right side. Perfect. And I'm pretty much there. Just a second. Perfect. And so now let me just quickly 
play the entire video for you from the start. So this is my rectangle slider moving from the left hand side of the screen to the right hand side of the screen. Let me just quickly play this entire thing for you once again. So as you can see guys, this is how you can create a rectangle slider in VSTC free video editor. Do let me know your thoughts in the coming section below. Like the video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. I will again see the next video. Till then thanks for watching.